First of all, thank you for your time, Dr. Alvars. Uh, we are at the IEA Transportation International Press Workshop. We are hearing companies about their participation at the IEA show at Hanover this year. What is the communication like from Krone this year, and what is the special or new developments at your uh, at your company? Yes, uh, we are quite happy that the uh, uh, IAR Motor Show will be held held uh, in, in September this year, and we have different different uh, things we will show. Uh, main topics are uh, digitalization, electrification and automatization. Uh, regarding the electrification, we will show uh, e-trailer. That means uh, a trailer with an electrified axle uh, plus uh, uh, battery packs. Depends uh, how long is the distance you will drive. And uh, this e-trailer will support the, the, the truck. And uh, you have two... two um, two important uh, um, uh, main, main topics in that side um, and advantages. That means, uh, first of all, we support the truck and the truck will, will uh, have less uh, fuel consumption and that mean, means also less uh, uh, carbon output. And on the other way, for electric uh, uh, battery uh, trucks, you can extend the, the, the uh, distance. Uh, standard uh, electric battery uh, uh, trucks will have a distance of between 350 and, and f uh, 500 kilometers and if uh, they use our e-trailer e they can extend it to, to 800 to 1000 kilometers. So while we understand that this development is happening towards electric axles and the whole electrification drive that is happening in Europe, uh, what there is one side where the manufacturers and the suppliers are ready with the product and solution. How has been the reception or acceptance from the customer side? What are their feedback? What do they require? And how are you addressing this gap? gap? So it's abs I think it's absolutely necessary for our customers that we can uh, serve new innovations for them because they are very interesting or interested uh, that we make the transport more efficiency so that they can save uh, fuel. Uh, less fuel consumption and also less uh, carbon output and that's the main inter uh, uh, interest uh, of our, our uh, customer of our clients okay and what's the percentage of market that is you know readily accepting the e-transition here in europe uh, and are there any other markets also that you are looking to explore in this e-mobility or the e-access that you spoke about yeah for corona trailers is the main market european uh, the european country uh, or the european countries and uh, Northern Africa and uh, the, the Turk countries uh, because we produce big, big uh, products and for us it makes no sense to produce these uh, products in Germany and to, to deliver it maybe for example to India. It's too expensive.